Chris? Is everything okay? What's going on? I ran out of mayonnaise. You can't be serious. I am. I was craving something sweet and delicious, and now I can't have it. Chris, if you were craving something sweet, I promise you there are better options than mayonnaise. Ooh, let me guess. You have some Mexican candy. Of course I do. But not just any Mexican candy, traditional Mexican candy. Where is this traditional Mexican candy that you claim is so much better than my beautiful mayonnaise? Open the left cabinet. I said left. Your other left. Open this one, Chris. The left cabinet. Oh, I knew that. <laughs> so what exactly am I looking at? Where are the candy wrappers? These candies were handmade, so there's no wrapper. They each take a long time to make and are made with simple ingredients, but most importantly, love. Ouch! No candy till I tell you what they are. I hate this part. These are called dulces cristalizados. Dulces cristalizados means crystallized candy. So what flavor is the red one? This is dulce de camote, or crystallized sweet potato. Sweet potato candy? That does not sound good. Oh, but I bet candied mayo sounds good to you, huh? Actually, yeah. That sounds delicious. Anyway, the crystallized sugar gives it that thick and sweet crust. Pure deliciousness. Ooh, can I try it now? No, I'm not done explaining. This next one is called Cocada. It's made with shredded coconut, milk, and sugar. I love coconut. This is dulce de leche. It's a candy made of milk and sugar topped with pecans. What about this one? It looks like a granola bar. That is a palenqueta. It's made with peanuts, seeds, and sugar. How do you eat it? It's a little hard. Yeah, it is, but it's delicious. And then we have alfajor. This one is made of coconut. And next, we have rollito de guayaba, or rolled candied guava. Not a fan of guava, but interesting. Next, we have ate de membrillo. It's a sweet jelly made from the pulp of a quince. Like a quinceanera? No, quince is a type of fruit. It's like a pear, but harder. Hmm. And lastly, we have cajeta. This is like caramel, but it's made with goat's milk. Goats make milk? Yeah, every mammal makes milk, Chris. I can make milk? Every mammal makes milk, but you're a... You know what? Never mind. So can I try the candies now? Yeah, but I'm gonna make you rank them. What do you mean by that? So why did I have to be tied up again? To add a little spice. Let's get started. First, you're gonna rank dulce de camote. The fact that it's sweet potato still doesn't sit right with me. I give it a three. Three out of 10? Your taste buds suck. But all right, let's try dulce de leche. Ah, it's a little too sweet for me. I'll give it a four. Four? You can't be serious. But all right. You're gonna like this one, cocada. I love coconut, too. <gasps> okay, I'm gonna find a candy you like. Next, palanqueta. Four. Alfajor. Two. <laughs> Rollito de guayaba. Uh, one. Ate de membrillo. Can I do a point five? Dulce de sila cayote. Definitely a three. <sighs> you know what, Chris? You've given every single candy less than five. But I know for a fact you're going to love this last one. Oh, yeah. Cajeta.
Mm. The flavor is so interesting. Way different than the others. It's, it's kind of milky, kind of like a little bit like caramel. Uh, I don't know, it, it just hits the mouth very different and the way it just lands on your tongue is just very, very interesting. But I gotta be honest with you, <laughs> I give it a zero. A zero? What? Are you crazy? <sighs> you know what? Good luck. <sighs> Wait, Ramon, where are you going? <laughs> Aren't you gonna come and tie me? Ramon! Ah, I think there's a storm coming! Ramon, come and tie me! Ah, 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 Ramon! Come on, please! I can't get wet! I just got this shirt! What is going on? We hope you enjoyed that video. If you liked it, give it a big like. And let us know down below in the comments if you tried any of these candies. Or just comment anything because we read every single comment. And don't forget to follow Javi at Hav Casanova. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. You're gonna untie me, right? Ramon! No! Guys! Don't come untie me, please! But no! And if you're still watching, comment down below, candy!